Titanfall! <laughs> yeah, that actually did work as a pretty good intro. Um, this is from the second night I was playing. It's not a great game because I haven't really had any great games, but this game, one thing that's so awesome about it is it makes everyone feel like they're a fucking beast. You know, because you got all those minions to kill, so if you get just a few deaths and a whole bunch of kills, a couple of player kills, some minion kills, you feel like a beast! And then you get in a Titanfall, you feel even more like a beast. Um, this one, I kind of just grabbed this one up, because I think this is the first one that Reyna actually watched me play. And uh, she wasn't interested in this game whatsoever until I finally got her to play it tonight, which is Monday night, actually. And this was played Saturday night. <clears throat> um, I've been looking forward to this game forever, and I am not disappointed one bit. This game is fucking beast as hell. Um, unfortunately, there's going to be some spots in here where it sounds like the audio cuts out. The audio did not cut out. I was in a Skype call with my cousin as we were playing, and it recorded his voice, but I wasn't recording mine. So I'll have some more videos coming up in the near future. Um, if any of you haven't seen them, I mean they're all over the internet, so if you're even remotely interested in this game, you've seen plenty of gameplay, and plenty of gameplay better than my gameplay, but, uh, you can watch as we play if you feel like it, and if you don't, then you don't have to watch it. Um, I'm hopefully gonna find a way to not have our Skype call be recorded in there, or maybe we'll just go party, maybe the party won't be recorded in there, but, um. That way I can just do some commentaries and it won't record the voices. Not sure how much you like commentaries though. A little bit more interesting than a live com because when I'm playing, if I'm going to play even halfway decent, I'm normally not talking much. One of those uh, mouth breathers in a way, I just kind of like sit there with my mouth open like a turkey staring at the rain. <laughs> well, I don't breathe like Do I breathe like that? No. Oh, thank I'm just, God. I'm just giving him an example. Gotcha. I mean, the parkour in this game, as you saw a little bit ago as I jumped up the building, that's insane. It took, like, that was one of the only good things from Brink, and it seems like they took that in and made it better. And you can get, I think I, I think I have my Titan out there. I wasn't paying much attention. Um, you can get your Titan, and you can have it set to just uh, guard mode, or you can put it to where it follows you around, or you can jump in it. Rodeoing Titans is real fun. I don't remember if I started doing that yet by this point. I, I really don't remember. I haven't been able to break myself away from playing this game for very long at all. I've been staying up real late every night playing the game. I almost fell asleep at work today, and I can't fall asleep. Like, I was waiting to clock out, and I had like half hour until I had to clock out, I had nothing to do, I was sitting down in a, in a chair, like a, not a recliner, a recliner would have been more comfortable, a pretty uncomfortable chair, and I found myself nearly passing out, because I've been playing this game so much, but the only reason why I'm playing it so much rodeo. is because, yeah, there, I did get a rodeo, awesome. Sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off. No, it's fine. Uh, that rodeo shit is beast, and this guy didn't even know I was on him until, I don't know if he ever Boom. knew. He's up there. Uh, yeah, I didn't kill him while he was in the air. I think I've killed one or two people while they're in the air. Not very many. I kind of tend to get lost. I'm like, what's going on? Um, but if you guys have not tried this game, you should definitely buy it when it comes out. If you even like first-person shooters at all. there's uh, I've read reviews from people who don't normally do good at pers first-person shooters, so they normally don't like it. But when they open the beta... For people who have Xbox One, they played it and they actually enjoyed it. And it's because you can do stuff to help your team even if you don't do too well. You can have fun even if you're not very good. And I think they did a great job on making it where everybody gets to feel like a badass without, you know, hurting anybody else. You know, it's you're not all PvP. You know, they're damn it, that's probably Booger scratching at the door. Um, it's not all PvP. You know, there's bots in there as well. The minions is what I call them. I, they might be called minions in general, too. Look at that Grunts. cloaked guy. Grunts, there you go. I just I call them minions for some reason. <clears throat> they seem more like they'd be minions. And, um... Yeah, the beta's very limited with what it gives, but it is amazing. The beta still delivers. It really does. Like I don't like first-person shooters. At all. Like, 
I struggle to keep concentration with the Call of Duty series. Oh, you know how everybody say, was saying that Titanfall is a COD killer? Oh, you better fucking believe it. It is definitely a COD killer. I don't, I don't know. I personally think Call of Duty killed <laughs> itself. Well, and, but it, even if Call of Duty was still running strong, I think this would be a COD killer. But, I mean, it's made by the people who made the two good Call of Duties, Modern Warfare 1 and 2, which has allowed the franchise to let out a bunch of crap for the last quite a few years, and everybody still buys it because of the feel. You know, the feel for aim up, the movement, that familiarity that was there, and then for, you know, the love of Modern Warfare 1 and 2, basically. That's why I kept buying them, was hoping that something could catch something like that again. This is much better than that even so I I thoroughly enjoy it whether I do good or bad I enjoy it like we had a game earlier um, tonight that it's open beta on limited servers so there's starting to be a decent amount of lag plus I think some people are hopping on there with their freaking you know no upload speed or download speed there's a guy with one bar and he was clicking around all over the place and it was almost impossible to kill him because he wasn't where he was. You know, you'd start shooting at him and then he'd stop and you'd keep shooting at him and then he'd click over. But that doesn't happen very often. And even with that, the game is beast. I mean, you, all, you always feel like you're doing a bunch of shit. Like, here we win this one. I have a few gameplays that I want to put up where we lost because it felt like we were doing so good. Like, if you don't look at the score, you think you're winning. You think you're kicking ass, you know. And there's times where when you go to look at the score, you're like, man, I could have swore I did so much more than that. Because, you know, you're fighting these titans and, you know, it's like you get titan assists. I don't know if they give you assists on it, but, like, when you dump into them and someone else gets that final kill... You're not even upset about it just because it's so beastly that that shit just exploded and you guys took it out. And I've been playing with my cousin Venom Blade, and uh, he's going to be putting up some videos about this soon as well, so you should check him out. He's going to do more, I believe he's going to go more with like highlights and stuff. I was barely even able to pull myself away from the game long enough to cut this up for now, so I'll hopefully be bringing you some more stuff soon. I don't even remember what I co recorded before, but yeah, there's the end of it. I think I pull up my score pretty soon. Pull up my score. Bring it on up. There we go. So that is 11 pilot kills, 1 titan kill, 14 minion kills. And three deaths. So that's a beast-ass KD. I only died three times, but I killed a shit ton of minions. Shh. Don't tell anyone.